Homes by Sangobang. Hello everyone and welcome to Homes. Today we are visiting Brazil. The country is currently facing a major challenge. Building 30 million new homes, mostly for precarious families parked in cramped and poorly designated housing. This is what Felipe Faria explains to us. He is the CEO of the Green Building Council, an organization that has accelerated the greening of Brazil's construction industry. When we heard 30 million, oh, it's a lot, it's a lot. And the focus should never be on quantity, but quality. So how can we manage a short construction budget? Because we are talking about affordable homes. Otherwise, if we have a new affordable project without any kind of concerns about acoustic lighting, biophilia, thermal and visual comfort, for sure in the day next, these new homes will enter for the statistics of the deficit because it shows some precarious conditions for families living in. So I think this is the main challenge. How we manage a short construction budget with comfortable, efficient, and sustainable. The green building concepts are an important part of the solution. Actually, the green building movement in Brazil is very active. So we have a lot of experience and a kind of maturity. And recently, we created our own certification tool for the residential sector. The main important is health and well-being. And then naturally, we started certifying new residential buildings and homes for the upper class. But we have some examples in affordable homes. <laughs> In Brazil, we have some developers who got success in following the same technical certification rules. So and the lesson that we learned is that investment in intelligence during the design phase and also consider pre-industrialized or industrialized construction methodologies. So I think this is the future. I think what is helping us to bring the green building movement for affordable housing project, one of the key points is the industrialized and pre-industrialized construction methodologies. This is the end of this episode. Thanks to Felipe Faria for helping us better understand one of Brazil's major current issues. And go to other episodes to better understand the local issues of homes. Mm-hmm.